Ghana versus Niger. The Ghana Blasters are disgracing us. How do you see the game? Uh, shambolic performance from the boys. We didn't expect this performance at all after losing uh, against Angola at the Mabai Sports Stadium. We blamed the particular result from the pitch and we were complaining that the pitch was not good. <coughs> and I spoke emphatically about the fact that if the pitch was not good at all, we should have at least put in some performance and I mean, uh, get a draw or a win. But in the, at the end, Angola took all the three points. And we were expecting to beat Niger at uh, what we call Morocco, Morocco because we were blaming on a good pitch exactly we were talking about the pitch and all every that all of that but clearly you can see that the boys are not patriotic at all and i think that they are they are i think they they take pleasure in wearing the uniform uh, and, and the jersey the and jersey. just mm -hmm. go around just amushi jama here and there and all mm -hmm. those stuff mm -hmm. but i mean uh, uh national football what mm -hmm. comes first is it's it's the country mm -hmm. that the mm -hmm. the the the, uni, your genus, the jersey you wear that's what comes first. You you don't have to be unpatriotic playing nonsense on the pitch here and there. Look at Thomas Party today. Is that is it the kind of football you play for us now? Mm -hmm. Look, nobody impressed me. Too. Nobody except Abrofu Manu, except for Tariq uh, Tariq Lamte, uh, even Antoine Semenyo gradually is becoming a true Ghanaian. Yes, a flop. A flop. He's understanding that no, I can't put in this much work, pressing all around, and at the end of the day, not get results. So I mean, gradually we are transforming in him into becoming a, a true Ghanaian, and that's what we saw from him today. We saw how Inaki Williams wanted to at least. I mean, do something for us today. He got a one, a chance today, and was going to score he, the goal. He, I think he could have even had an assist today. You understand? So I was, mean, yeah. Today it was very shambolic. Nothing worked for Ghanaians, and you could you could see from the face of Otoado that Otoado was angry. I mean, he did, he has done what he can be, uh, he can do. We brought him for one purpose, and the purpose was was, was to play beautiful football and, win and to be, and to win games. And at least he's trying to play the foot, uh, beautiful football. But the boys are not putting in their best. These are players who play in Europe, who day in and day out. We are going to watch them this week, uh, weekend uh, on, on La Liga, on, on uh, Premier League. You see what Kudus will do at West Ham. You will see what Pate will do at Arsenal. You, you see what Abdul Moumen. I am I, I, I'm surprised at Abdul Moumen. You, go, you just go your W. This is your first chance to prove to uh, Ghanaians and the coach that you deserve a chance. You deserve a chance when we go to competitive games like the Afghan Cup or the World Cup. You deserve the chance to play. And here, here you come and you are playing this football like we are begging you to play. Now, the standards must be set that if any player will come and will not give in his best, we are not asking for 10%, we are not asking for 20%, we are asking for a 100% performance. Because if the pitch is not good, we, 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 are, we are complaining about the fact that the pitch was not good, so they were afraid to, to get injured and everything. <laughs> what about today? The pitch was good and there, no, there was nothing that showed that uh, the, the Nigerians want to wanted to hurt the players or anything i mean we did not give our best mm -hmm. that was it so it was a shambolic performance from the boys and at, at going forward we must take drastic decisions that will change the team we cannot continue watching the blasters team perform like this uh, this was not how they played we have had successive uh, shambolic performances from the boys and it's, it feels like it's becoming a thing like that's how it will become and if Ghanaian stock you see kudus go online replying and telling people we should shut the phone when he up you see salisu get angry coming back to to insult Ghanaian. you see some players showing like i don't know it's how like this look at the football he plays at leicester but when it comes to ghana he does not do anything so i mean shambolic ashima i told you here that ashima is not going to change anything people were saying change uh, elisha Usu and bring in ashima it's not about the matter of achievement. The boys are not committed. They don't want to put on all their best. And if you don't put in all your best, what you're going to see is that at the end of the day, a country like Niger will, will score. And at the end of the day, you, they, we might even have lost. You understand? Yes, so yes, it was, yes. It was, it was, I mean, the, the last minute they had a... a it was, yes. a, we nearly lost the, it was a, a poor performance from all the boys, yes. from the technical team and everything. We got everything wrong today, yes. So who are you going to blame? Otto the players or... The pitch again. I am blaming. Uh, no, the, the today the, we can't talk about the pitch. Mm -hmm. I am blaming Otto Ado. Mm -hmm. I am blaming uh, the players, but the players will take 80 percent of of today's <coughs> performance. Otto Ado did what he, he can do best. He, he set his team up 
perfectly to win a game. Ah, uh, exactly. So when a, a, t- a coach sets up his team and s- and does everything well, what do you expect him to do? We Ghana is gradually becoming like Manchester United. They have had Manchester United. They have had different coaches. We see more, you know. But the players are not showing up. So the issue with Manchester United is we, we are Ghana Ghanaians are. Tr- uh, just uh, gradually turning into Manchester United, and before you realize, we would, we, this is not a matter of changing coaches and changing coaches. Even if you bring Pep Guardiola, these players are not willing to to commit themselves to the Ghana national team. And I don't know what. So the the best thing to do is to the, is to bring in the local boys. If you can play, if you can play with in Swaziland, the players are in Swaziland. They are all Ghanaians. Ah, now say, now say, let's bring them. Ah, they can face this. The yes. You understand? They, they can play against Niger. They can they can do better. You understand? Even if has for from Munyadi, bring them. They will play against Niger properly. Who do you know at Niger apart from apart from? I don't even know one player going to this game. <laughs> I didn't even know any player at Niger. How uh, explain to me how the Ghanaian players uh, about six? Uh, 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 what my confused because seventy percent of our team play uh, in Europe, Europe and we can't score these people. Shambolic performance. Yes, Charlie. Let's talk about uh, uh, Ghana's early lead. I'll decide. I'll decide. What she go and move with that? Go on. Or you are say you think that um, the goalkeeper was not good enough? It was. It was. It was in tones. It was. It was. <laughs> uh, the, the guy was just striking. He didn't even know that it, it would have scored. You mm-hmm. understand? Mm-hmm. So this game, we went in in a game without without a, the coach went in with a plan, but the the guys, the boys did not agree with him. They underrated the, the team. It, they didn't underrate the team. They they just made up their mind that we are not going to play, and that's what they did. Every football team, you know, you can see from their expressions on the pitch. <coughs> you know, when watching the ball, I told you that uh, uh, Pate, I have never seen him play for Arsenal whilst he walks. Works. Walk he will up. not walk. You will not see Pate walk. You will not see him. You will be, you will be jogging like, even if it's without the ball, he will be jogging around, jogging, reading the pitch. But today we saw a Pate walking. Mm-hmm. It seems like people, what people are seeing is true that he does not deserve the captain's unbound. Yes, a captain because cannot be in the middle. He should, should be telling his boys that, hey, you're more born. But Salisu is doing a, 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 a much better job at instructing the boys than Pate. Hey, can you imagine? I expect more from Pate. You play, I don't know if it's all about senior man, senior man, you drop me. If Abu Francis will get the opportunity and play, let him play. Let him play. If uh, what Ibrahim Osman will get the chance and play, let him play. If the boys back home, Kotoko players now now say in Swaziland and now this boy, bring them and let them, bring them, let them because some of them they have nothing to lose. And if you give them half of the amount you are giving to these Black Stars players, they'll do they'll put on in the best. At least we'll see, some, we'll see something. To the, the 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 motive is to is to I mean is to uh, bring a new ideology to the Ghana national team. What best ideology can we give to these young players that are at Ainswatermani, that are at Ebiana? This, that I'm, I'm saying, if Patemo Omo Mobona, this is the next, next initiative we have to take. Bring in the young boys, in, inspire them, bring these ideologies into their mind that this is what we want to play. They will play the ball. Mm-hmm. They, they, they have no fear of getting injured. They have no fear of saying, say, I'll lose my spot at Arsenal, I'll lose my spot. And that's nonsense I've ever heard that I'm playing for Arsenal, so I'm afraid that I'll lose, I'll get hurt, so I'm not giving my. And more, and more, Senegal, you know what? Baba Mama, I'll catch one No, what has happened to us? You understand? Baba Mama said, you know, come. All what we did, all my man interested. They die you. Issue back and forth, nobody to complain, and he's sitting at his place. So, if Tapate will not play, if Kudu should not play, focus on the West Ham mm-hmm. because you see, they I say market you, you see, so nobody people don't want football nowadays, they will go and point out should Otoado step on the pitch and come and play the football. Mm-hmm. No, he's, he's instructed you do this, do this. Everybody can affirm for the fact that can for, confirm that. Uh, the, the, the strategy we, we went in, it's a beautiful st- uh, strategy. The people, Niger, Niger for all of them were back, defending, defending, defending. But here but, lies. But, but talking about the setup, I think that I will partly blame Otaru because he's seen if you are playing a possessive football and you are not able to break the defensive lineup, the defensive back line of your, of your opponent, then you probably have to look at your wingers. So, Semenyo and then Semenyo and then Fatah Isaku must be able to beat that. This markets. match is not about tactics. See, the three back, five back, four, four, two, four, three, three, and a co match. We should have scored Niger. It, like, they are not a match for us. You don't understand. I understand. They are not a match for us. They shouldn't, we shouldn't even be talking about tactics, tactics too much. We should use our third best place and even score them. It's true. That's what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. Because clearly, <coughs> it, it's, it's like you are saying that Manchester City goes into a match and they are using Rico Lewis, they are using uh, O'Reilly and everything. And they play the normal formation that Guardiola plays. And they meet uh, an Ipswich side 
uh, uh, losing down and they are not yeah. playing well. Like, no, they will and still you play. say that uh, Garilla should bring in Dogu and no, he has set in a place. This place you are you are qualified to play for the Manchester City setup because we need more than one So we call this place because we see in, we see them there. Nobody had a problem with the call up that Otuado did this particular uh, in this particular qualifiers. Nobody had problems because Obiama, the players that he called, Omani, other players that did not come were injured. Nobody can say that there was this player performing here. Right? We didn't call. There was this. No, this was the best call up he could have brought up uh, amidst all the players that we had. Mm-hmm. So if he brought all these players and uh, we can't play the kind of football, and the players are not giving him their best. Then Antoine Semenya, you're twenty nine. Then and then Otuado, uh, party plays more like he's a snail in a midfield, a midfield where uh, uh, the the uh, for Niger for Nigeria trying to stop the player. Yeah. And we can't play uh, today. How many offsides did Black Stars we need? Six or eight offsides. We made plenty of sides, professional players. You let the Niger- Nigerians or whatever catch you or set you offside, offside, offside to the extent that we have to play long balls. It doesn't make any sense. Hmm. It's like at a point in time, the commentator for the match said that this is a usual, it's like a usual a training for, for, Black, for stars. Black Stars. Yeah, the money they are gone. And this is a this is a match that if country Mansungu comes to comment on, I'll give on him on that. Yeah, because it was this really is an issue we have we have been commenting on. This is not a matter about Andrew Dada you. This is not a matter about um uh, Jordan are you. It's about oh, everything about the team. We are not we are not patriotic enough. We don't have the I don't know what's I say, going I say, on. It's like we beg them to come and play for us. That the Ghana first year ninja. Um, uh, the politicians are deceiving us. So at least we want my mom be not no. Accountability. Next time, uh, se- somebody must sit Otuado down and tell Otuado that Otuado, if you want to really discredit your name on, and, and put a dent on your name on the on the black star job, so be it. You better start acting out. Yes, yes. Sir. Take bold decisions like you did. With, did are you? Did are you? If Otuado will come and he will not play, put him on, on the, the bench. bench. If John are you will come, no, but you I am not going to you, you see them play our social media and also um our uh, europe every day this is not a performance they give no 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 it's it's totally uh, nonsense because at the end of the moon one chain our market women the normal normal Ghanaians that have been t- taking tax and yet the man will say one more boy mind and if you can't play Otuado, the next decision is up to you then after is now what we have to do is that we have to win all our games we have to play sudanes and we'll go our way to uh, uh, Angola, Niger will, Niger will come here. I think they have a sweet do calculation every day. We are losing, and it's coming from nonsense equalizers. We will we'll score one, and we'll have many opportunities to score. And we'll look at it could, today the opportunity could do smith. Mm. You should have done something about it. You don't make even, even, even the last one, cry, Puno. you understand. So, I mean, it's, it's everywhere, not about them. Everywhere, everywhere, yes. Charlie, let's talk about Atizigi, Lawrence Atizigi. For me, I, I don't think he can be our number one goalkeeper if we are going to play this brand of football. The brand of football where we are passing the ball, passing on the back. He can add up to become part of the defensive line, but he doesn't seem to be really good at his feet. How do you see John? How do you see Atizigi? Should at, be at number one? Atizigi, you see, Atizigi, Atizigi is issue. issue eh? It has. It's a, it's a matter of the past. Everybody, every Ghanaian knows now that it's because we lack goalkeepers. Mm-hmm. That is why he's he's, he's an option now. We lack goalkeepers, and the very <coughs> the one who can compete with him, who who could have competed with him was uh, what do we call him, uh, Jojo Walakot. Jojo Walakot. But Jojo Walakot was Unfortunately, he does not have any club now, and the club that he has called Onyaminchi. He play, plays for Crawley. You understand? Yeah. Onyaminchi. So it's very sad. Mm-hmm. So Otuado uh, Lawrence Atiski, he on a, he has game time, and I mean with the Black Stars, he has confidence and experience. That's why we've been calling him. But if a goalkeeper outside can make, I mean can make advances and i mean we can call him and replace him there is no competi- uh, co- competition for that's why he's doing that mm. the kind of football that we want to play i mean and that's what i'm saying this particular match this niger match at this game no, yeah, yeah. we don't expect much from him oh yeah yeah go it, it was poor the attitude was poor nothing better from them and when we say it was my mind I just say you know, it's just one thing. You have to So at this this issue here, at this this issue, we continue to pain because if we meet a side that knows how to score goals, that knows how to do, now Ghana we cannot. Niger, I'm ranking 125 mm. on FIFA ranking. And Niger, boy, boy. And you are playing with Niger, Niger, mm-hmm. Niger. Mm-hmm. What if you met Morocco? Mm. Now Ghana, we can't compete with Morocco. We Senegal. can't compete with Cameroon, Ivo Senegal, uh, 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 Nigeria. We can't compete with them. Those squads. 
because they have this <coughs> now, now look at Morocco. They are doing they've added Brahim Gas to their setup. They've added I mean oh Akumanu was here before my Ghanaians no and a kudus and a kudus and a kivo gari and a kudus and a kudus and a ADD boy is eating so when they come kudus can play 90 minutes in this game of football or more she you know 90 minutes in the room untouchable because he's kudus then we should go and blame we should go and blame who but what is also part mm. understand you should and why you have joseph pinto on the bench you have why did you bring francis abu test him mm. why Omar, did you bring us awesome. uh, we saw Brandon, awesome. i thought brandon thomas was coming to be a man or by no about wings so poor performance from the guys yes so you blame atizigi for the for the goal you considered no it was it was poor defense it was poor defense i've told you that these guys are not committed. They are, they are not ready to play for Black Stars. They are not committed at all. At all. This was, a, there was an easy clearance. But then the BIA petition go when there is a corner, when there is a corner kick, and they get the Guinness, it means that these people were not committed enough to clear the ball. So, me sometimes today, when I was watching them, I asked myself that. This, did, did these people train before playing this football? You guys have been here around for about a week or so. Didn't you train before this particular match, and you concede from this this error? I mean, it's, it's an error. It means that we have no look, we have no look at that and from that part. When we have uh, trainers to coaches who are looking at that as aspect too, so we must look at all these things. You should get uh, a trainer who looks how we do. We do not concede defense. From how we defend against set pieces. We have top players and we we, we concede from, from such a goal. Any serious team, time you concede and put, you concede around 81, 81 mm-hmm. minutes. We had about nine minutes to do something. Nine Try. minutes in the end. Yeah. We could have one chance. I could this boy out. You understand? I could, that, oh, mm-hmm. could ask about the compensable. I've told you today. Could you today? This, this was not the Kudus I saw at Babayara. Mm. I'm telling you, Babayara called. We played, we played a much better game at Babayara today. Ma- yeah. we, we, go and watch the boy game. We played a much better game at Babayara. We were complaining about the pitch, but we played a much better game. Or the bad so pitch. I don't know, excuse me, the said, uh, na fans in Nihuntia. You understand? <coughs> so I'm saying that going forward, we should not blame uh, not people around. It's the football people. We are not, and the players too, they are not committed. Some time ago, we were talking about Chris Whittier. The players are not committed. You see, how Tuadu and Nathan Tessin right? He's bringing, we will complain the fact that, about the fact that once started Ashimi Ruin, until now he opened. Ashimi Ruin started. He started. He started him from the six, but fine. Osan Sisaye, he brought Thomas Pate to the number eight and pushed Ashimi Ruin. Still. So it's not a matter about Ashimi Ruin or Pate. On also Sway 9, when he gets injured and he goes, so that's the mentality. Mi pra, mi pra. And the ball, both for Yano, mi pra. No. Charlie, uh, let's talk tactics, tactics, small tactics. I said 5 4 1. Niger was defending a 5 3 2 or 5 4 1 setup. I think in the last 10 minutes it was 5 3 2. But if you are if, if you are opposition and you want to win, I think that if at least if Kudus cannot play in the central positions, we try and push him on the wing. Because we know that one of, one of Kudus' best abilities to try and beat him, beat his marker. It's made the one yard for the brown wing, so they beat him, I cannot create opportunities. Because you see, set target to Banilima, or probably a man. But my own to me, entry. You get my point. So I think that Otaru also has, has a, part, a big part to blame because if Kudus cannot play as a number 10 or as a SS, maybe as, as a winger. That's true. Tactics wise, you understand. But that's, that's what I'm saying. That <laughs> we are talking like we, are to- we will talk about tactics because these boys were not committed in the first place. Okay. We see what they need for a while. See, I'm a football assistant here, but I'm on Niger, Niger, who? You understand? And in as much as you say that I'm disrespecting, maybe someone wants me, I'm, 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 I'm disrespecting them or anything. I'm not disrespecting them. That's the, yeah, that's the fact. Truth. Morocco was going to jail. Cote d'Ivoire was going to jail. Cameroon was going to jail. Everyone, every top tier team will score in jail. Estonia was going to jail. Some, 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 because clearly, <laughs> um, if they were they were serious, they were scored Ghana because mm. um, they they had a counter four against two, mm. and if this was was a match composed side, they were scored Ghana. They go and they put no more prepare and they go. They were even uh, uh, surprised that they scored. Yes. So the coach, me me a coach, and I'm going to play against Ghana. All I'll say is that, yes, it, uh, it seems that it has been working for all coaches. Sit back, in the five back defense, mm-hmm. only attacking player three. Uh, a three back, mm-hmm. just through the ball, long balls, 
and ran. Mm-hmm. You scored them. Mm-hmm. That's true. That's like, so, it worked for Angola. Yes. And it's also worked for uh, Niger. So going to the next game, I'm not sure Kusi Kusi Apia will have much of a headache going to a, g- a game against Black Stars. You just say, eh, Monty actually. Because Otoado clearly, you he said he will play possession t- uh, s- uh, football. And when he plays possession football too, he will possess football. We know that coaches know so like we will throw the ball in. So our 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 full backs and our defense must stay alert. Mm-hmm. Must stay alert at all times. Because in that set setup, tactics wise, in that f- f- possessive football, four back, four three, three flat now, your boy, uh, you know. Today at a point in time, five five attackers were in the half of uh, AE and uh, and uh, it was left a few people <coughs> at the back. back. Yeah, and so still, you're not passing the ball. I don't understand. understand. I, I think, don't care. I think coaching has to say there's, there's something wrong with the coaching. That's what I'm saying. So they must if that's the f- kind of football you want to play, Shehanambo mm-hmm. ha pass, we mm-hmm. will pass mm-hmm. our crosses was enough mm-hmm. for us. Mm-hmm. I literally say that's why sometimes we, you need a, a natural left left foot left back. Uh, mm-hmm. You know, no about left back. Mm-hmm. Home. So sometimes some crosses be a two come. We had we had tall players like Inaki. We couldn't swing in some crosses at all because the one ball five back. You can cross in hey, from that point. Crossing. Just cross. It's how Strandi. I don't know. So how come? Uh, so about six offside. Today we uh, so saw him. What, what type of play did he play today? I thought that Otuado would have taken him off uh, because that's his attitude. Hey. Yeah, and that's my that's also my argument because you have Ibrahim Osman, who is also a direct winger. Yeah, Who's a direct right. winger? Charlie. So uh, and the issue also uh, from uh, 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 Otuado, I think I feel like you come and say that I take the fault. I know, but going forward, we need to come to me tonight. Come as a Ghana qualifier, and go African Cup. World Cup, yeah, the World Cup, I come African Cup, so I'm qualifier. So it should not be an issue for me. When I, when I saw the group of first Ghana, Sudan, Angola, Angola, I think Niger. you should have picked six points for oh, the first a long time. So how can we pick one point out of six? It's a failure for 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 Otuado and the boys. They should they should bow down their heads in shame, but on mm-hmm. move they don't care. Mm-hmm. That's the issue. The players no more bonia yet. I mean, we care more than them. They they don't care. On fun, on fun, on kubabo ma ba ma ma. Because we are at the end, you be tired no. On any agents no, no more buy no. This one will sort this one. This one is sort. Until the say you show up. We walk across the main back. I beg you, please show up for me. You just show up. Omo chwe nuka na film. Ah, these boys, they are not committed. They don't show anything. I feel like these are the times that we miss. The Thomas Pate, uh, the the Namante, them and all these people, like I'm not want the ginger and those things on the pitch. Amante was a much better captain than Thomas Pate. No instruction, no coordination. Everyone does whatever it is. We see Ali to say do. Pate now he was throwing the ball. Some balls we had so throw. We saw yes, he only the only person that received the ball. Person BBC at Ali Namante. He wants to make something happen. Not the ball, no go. And Nike Williams was so eager to put in a goal. She said, I know some stupid people will sit online and say that and I Nike if you want more shit, Nike can watch it. Nike can watch it because one one fab one man, woman chance on Kobe. You see Nike drop back to come and take the ball. Today I was I was very much disappointed in, in Antoine Semenyo. And whatever happens, Charlie, these boys they don't care about us. At the point that you say in so far and why you because team they are they gonna for there. So if these boys will not play, just disband the team and bring in boys who play. Mm. If under twenty, I know remember ball no? because we have much more talent in this country. So could do something on the West Ham no more. You understand? Mm. No more. But they want us now. So 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 we pray. I want us now. No, on yet the person here. We will find people who will play him. No more ball. Perfect. We will not even say say. Ah, I have no. Who knew today? Yeah, we will not talk about AC and then as much as we put you. So Charlie. Going forward, we should look at the Otuado should make bold decisions because you know, yeah, person here. Mm-hmm. He has he has clearly shown us how that five year contract. So. He, I mean, he wants to do something with the team, but if the the resources he have, no, he has the M1. You should just disband the team, talk to the men, the men, no more agents, 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 no Yeah. So, I'm going to say, how can you play against Belgium and the Brazil and then? <laughs> Charlie, conclusions. So, can Ghana qualify for the AFCON in Morocco? On, until something changes. Ghana for the, and that is what I want to, I want to be very realistic here. Uh, Ghanaians, we, we know this thing has happened, uh, you understand? Mm-hmm. We have four matches to play. Mm-hmm. And I know for a fact that if we get uh, our, our things right, I think the situation currently also is a part of the reason why Ghanaians play some some people one. They just started the season, and some of them they are like like a difficult attitude. Some people are born in They are afraid they will get injured and everything. Some people are born. But if everything being equal, all things being equal, if we score Sudan, 
if we score Niger, we, Niger will come to our home. I don't know if the by that we had fixed. Mamaya Rats for Niger, we go away to Angola. We will go to away to Angola. And we'll play back to back. If we we'll play Sudan. and we get I mean, I don't think that Niger and Sudan can over I said two two Neko. Mm. So I, I don't think that Niger and Sudan can overpass us and go. So going for I'm very confident that going forward we'll qualify. But if we play the, with this attitude, I think Sudan will score because Sudan scored Niger. Mm-hmm. And this is Christian I'm talking about here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It can surprise us mm-hmm. and score. So going forward, I feel like we can we can qualify, but it all depends on the attitude of the players. Of the players, yes. Charlie guys, I'm really upset, but I mean let me know what you think about this in the comment section. I'll respond to you the best yet come. Bye for now.